Hi and welcome students. Today I'm going to be talking to you about Windows 10 and how to create folders. Let's go ahead and get started. So first thing that you see here is my desktop. Now the first thing that you should do when you're looking at your desktop is see if you have a, an icon right down here. It looks like a folder icon and it's called File Explorer. If you hover over it, it'll eventually say File Explorer and you can open it up by clicking on it. Now what happens if you don't have File Explorer down here in the area that's called your taskbar? Well, how you're going to do it is, your, or how you're going to find it rather, is by pressing the Windows key, okay, or you can go down here and click on the Windows button in the bottom left, and then you're going to type in File Explorer, okay. You'll see it right there, and let's say you want it in your taskbar, you could go up to it, right click, and go to Pin to Taskbar, okay. Mine says Unpin because I already have it down here, and once you do that, it'll appear right down here on your taskbar. All right, so let's go ahead and open up File Explorer here. Now, File Explorer has a navigation menu along the left side, and so we're going to be discussing how to create folders. And so first thing that we need to do is figure out a place to actually put these folders. I'm going to choose this PC. When I choose this PC, it's going to save most of this on my uh, hard drive here. So. Uh, that is my C drive, and so if I go ahead and click this PC, it expands a menu. I could go right here to Documents. Now let's, I, let's say I have school coming up and I want to get ready for school and I have a Microsoft Office class. Well, I might want to create a folder that is called Microsoft Office 2016. So what I'm going to do is right click in any of the blank space, okay? Now keep in mind, you can't click in any of this area up here because it'll actually activate whichever one you are on. Okay, so we don't typically want to do that. Rather, we want to right click down here on any of this blank space. Once you right click, you can go right down here to where it says new, and then you can choose to create new documents or this right up here at the top, which is new folder. Once you click on folder, it will create a new folder right here and it'll be highlighted in blue, meaning if you just start to type, it'll automatically delete and replace that text with the text that you are typing. So I'm going to type in Microsoft Office 2016. To finalize the text and make sure that that is uh, the name of the document, I'm going to press enter. Once I press enter, it finalizes the name of that uh, file folder and then I could double click it to enter into that folder. All right, now obviously it says this folder is empty. That's because I've just created it and I haven't done anything with it. Now let's say I wanna add in some more folders. So I'm inside of a Microsoft Office uh, 2016 folder. I know that because right up here, it says Microsoft Office 2016. This area shows you your pathway of how you got here. You went to this PC, Documents, and then you created the Microsoft Office 2016 folder. Now I need to create folders for each of the uh, software applications that I'm going to be using in Microsoft Office. So again, I right click in the blank space, I go to new, and I choose folder. This time I'm going to call it Word for Microsoft Word. And then again, I press enter. Okay. Now we see a Word folder appears in the Microsoft Office 2016 area. All right, so now I created a Word folder. Now I'm going to create an Excel folder, but this time I'm going to show you a different way to create folders. Now right up here along the top, you can see this icon right here. It says New Folder. Once you uh, see that, you can click it, and it's going to automatically create a new folder. So it does the exact same um, operation as the previous one, and I'm going to call this PowerPoint and press Enter to finalize that. Now, notice that when I scrolled or when I went over this, it says new folder, and then in parentheses it says Control Shift N. Control plus Shift plus N, or N rather. That means if I hold down the Control button on my keyboard, hold down the Shift button on my keyboard, and then hold down the N button on my keyboard, look what it does. It creates me a brand new folder. So we've now figured out three different ways to enter in a new folder into. Uh, this file explorer menu. So I create four folders in total. I have Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and Access. I have my full four folders right here. Now I'm ready to go with the semester and I can uh, go ahead and start saving to these folders as well. So uh, that's how you create folders inside of Microsoft Windows 10. You do it within the file explorer. 
uh, organizing your files is very, very important because uh, you will actually be able to find them if you organize them correctly. Remember, every time uh, somebody organizes files poorly, it's the same thing as having a bunch of papers on your desk. You have trouble finding them. So I hope this video helped you out. If it did, give it a thumbs up. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel, and if you have a video request, please put it in the comment section. I'll be happy to make a video for you. Thank you so much for watching.